This is the LG Xenon, a mid-level messaging device for AT&T. Features a full touch screen and a full QWERTY keyboard. Taking a quick spin around the hardware, we see just three, so uh, three hard keys on the front, send and end key and a menu key. On the left side, we've got the volume toggle, which has a good travel and feedback and stands out nicely from the side of the phone. On the right, we've got a lot more going on. We've got a dedicated camera key here, screen lock key there, and a hatch covering the micro SD port. On the top is where you'll find a hatch covering the mini USB port for charging and data transfer. On the back, you can see the camera and flash, and of course, the nice blue coloring that almost matches my shirt. Opening it up, we have a nice four-row QWERTY keyboard here. The keys are nicely defined. They have a good, uh, good feel to them, good travel and feedback. We've got dedicated messaging buttons here along the left side. You can see a emoticon button, email button, instant messaging button, a dedicated media net button to take you straight to uh, the internet. And uh, on the right side, you can see dedicated at symbol buttons and a dot com button for filling out uh, Twitter addresses and email addresses and such. And uh, the uh, Z9 uses the touch user interface that we've seen on other LG touch phones uh, with a few upgrades to it. Looking at the main menu, we have uh, this tab menu system that we've seen before. Um, but the new standout feature is, uh, is back here on the home screen. Looking at the contacts, you have user configurable three sets of contacts. So for example, you can have one set of contacts that are your family, another set that is your uh, you know, coworkers, and a third set that is your, uh, is your friends. Uh, so it's just a nice way to lump together or, or partition your contacts. So that is a quick look at the LG Xenon messaging device for AT&T.